want to uh, appreciate uh, His Excellency the Governor for creating some time so that uh, we can make this built into laws now. Uh, we want also to thank the honorable members for the efforts that they put into making sure that uh, we have the correct contents in the bill and uh, especially on the on the on the peace bill uh, and you know west pokot county we have been having challenges along uh, our borders and uh, many other places so we it's just putting structures into into the the county uh, on how we address these issues of uh, insecurity so they are all contained in the bill and uh, uh, it gives also powers uh, it generates some committees also so that they can be a formal way of addressing conflicts within our borders so we think and we know that uh, it will go a long way into trying and solving the conflict that we are having between us and our neighbors um we have had perennial uh, issues of conflict uh, between our county and other neighboring counties and we found it very important to have uh, um, a directorate that will help us to coordinate on issues of peace building, conflict resolutions, uh, especially within our borders, because we can't do anything without having uh, a peaceful society. So we found it necessary so that we have a better coordination on, on issues of peace, because over time, it is only the national government which has been coordinating on issues of peace. So we have been operating on an ad hoc way. And I think uh, this bill will go a long way to give us a better strategy. And now we can deal with issues of conflict uh, because we can be able uh, to allocate resources on issues of peace building. And that is very uh, key because one of the factors that has made us to lag behind is issues of um, conflicts within our region, and we want to get a long-lasting solution. And I think this uh, bill which I have ascended this morning to law will really give us the structures, the necessary structures that will help us as a county in issues of uh, peace, peace building and uh, conflict management. Hapo awali hatukukuwa na sheria yote ambayo ilikuwa inashughulikia na maneno ya amani na kungekuwa na tukio lolote la ukosefu la usalama hapa kukuwa na mtu ambaye angeweza kupanga wengine ili kushughulikia mambo hayo na kwa hivyo wakati tumepitisha hii sheria inaweza kusema kwamba ni nani ndio mwenyekiti ya kikao hiki ya kuitisha maneno ya amani ambapo kwa hii sheria tumeweka ni governor wa kishirikiana na county commissioner kuna other members kama wale eh, police commander CC sanaya uhusika na maneno ya amani CEOs na watu wengine wa shikadao ambao wanahusika na maneno ya amani kwa hivyo kwa maneno ya mipangilio sasa tuko sawa kwa sababu sasa tunajua matukio ya ukosefu ya amani kitokeza kitokezea katika kaunti yetu tunajua ni nani anaitisha mkutano na vile vile pia eh, tumeweza kuratibu wale mashirika ya sio kiserikali waweze kujumuika nasi katika maneno ya kutafuta amani watakuwa wanakuja kuketi na sisi alafu tunakuwa na mipangilio ya zile programs ama project wanataka kufanya tusije kuwa tunafanya maneno eh, sawa kwa pamoja tutaweza kugawa ile areas watakuwa wanafanya pengine wengine watashughulikia maneno ya peace committees wengine watashughulikia ile tunaita resilient projects ya kuweza kusaidia maneno ya amani wengine watashughulikia pengine maneno ya policies na mambo mengine mengi